So one of the things I like about the Hunter I-20 sprinkler is that it has a flow shutoff built uh, directly into the sprinkler. So any one sprinkler, you can turn the water off either permanently or temporarily while you change the nozzle. Uh, an example here in my house, I'm actually gonna turn one of the sprinklers off because I need to replace it with a 12 inch uh, sprinkler and uh, temporarily what I'm gonna do is just turn it off until I get around to that. And so I've got uh, with me the Hunter key and I'm gonna show you how it's done. So the sprinkler in question is down here at the bottom of the driveway. You can see that it's not uh, tall enough or it's just kind of sunk over time and it's really throwing water right into the lilies. So what we're gonna do is clean off the top. And I'm gonna insert the key so you feel it fall into position and then turn it clockwise until the water turns off and that's it. So the sprinkler will pop up and down, but no water will come out. And this planting bed here is actually getting hit by two other sprinklers. So it'll be okay for now. And again, that's the reason I like the I-20 because it's got the built-in flow shut off, which makes it really easy and convenient to change your nozzles and control the flow of water all the time. So that's it nerds. Until next time, Andy out.